and welcome to this tutorial. Today I'm going to tell you how to turn on error reporting in a Joomla website. The reason I do this is because I've installed Joomla 3.4 several times and while it worked, it didn't work when I logged out and logged back in. The admin page gave me a blank page. Well, a blank page is actually a, a sort of a hidden error page. It's actually an error page, but it shows like a blank page. So what we're going to do is we're going to click on system. We go to global configuration. And then we go to the server here. This is the server. And then we got here, we got error reporting. If you go to maximum or development. Click on save. And now you're going to actually go to the main page. And then you also will see errors here. Main page, front page, okay. And now we are going to we're going to see here we got an error two stick standards This is the admin page the, the back end that is still without having done any update. We go back to the administrator page. And now we go to click on update now. Install the update. Now it's updating. It's now on Joomla version 3.4 extensions. Extension manager. Database is also in 3.4. And now the next step is just to log it out to see it will work. System, because the last time it didn't work. The log out. And now we get a blank page again. The home administrator it still is a blank page without any errors shown. And it's still with the expired headers on the top. Oh well, this is a. I want to bring it back online again, the website. So I'm going to go to the Joomla 3.36 table thing again. And just they're going to extract it here, extract files, 
since I want to go back to the investigator, I use an, the older version, Joomla 3.36. And I'll go back to the installation file here because I don't need it. I'm going to delete it. Delete file. Now I'm going back to the, let's see, the home Zesme administrator here. And like you can see, it has an error in here of the Amiga thing. I don't know what the Amiga thing is for, so I'm going to check that bit later on. I'm now going to turn off error reporting and again, global configuration. You go, we are going to server, we're going to none, not too simple, okay, now it's gone, now we're going to the home accessory page again, well, then we go to none, click save, Then we will click refresh. Errors are now gone. No more errors for us. And now we go to save and close. And then we go to extensions, extension manager. Then we go to database. And you go click fix. Now it will go back to the Joomla 3.36. Plus that's built in with Joomla, that's the good part. And now we go back to the system. System information here. And we we'll see that the system is back to Joomla 3.36 table. The database is also back to the 3.36 table. I will post these errors to the Joomla forum and hopefully somebody will be help, helping me to figure out how I can get rid of these errors. I hope you liked this tutorial and I hope you will be back to my site soon and to my channel soon. To to fix more of my tutorials.